You know, the instigator is that we've had a tragic accident in West Vancouver on December 30th. Um, this is a small community and that has hit all of us very hard. At least seven clothing donation bins in West Vancouver have been sealed up. With a sign informing potential donors, the bins are temporarily closed. District staff decided to take action after a 34-year-old man died when he got stuck in this bin on Sunday. So we immediately started looking at the question of public safety because that's our number one concern. And uh, yesterday we decided that until we have a, a permanent solution, we need to take temporary measures to ensure the safety of the clothing donation bins. At least seven Canadians have died in clothing donation bins since 2015, and five of those deaths have taken place in B.C. One homeless advocate in Vancouver's downtown east side calls the bins death traps and says something needs to be done. There are so many risks and things that can take your life when you're homeless and a donation bin shouldn't be one of them. We've been calling for these donation bins to be fixed for years now. Um, people continue to die. It's totally horrific and unacceptable. We need to do better. Even one of Canada's largest manufacturers of bins similar to the ones in West Vancouver says it is open to making whatever changes are necessary to improve safety. We've been working with the uh, University of British Columbia to try and come up with a design that suits everybody's needs. Products that are out there, used in what they're intended for, could never possibly hurt anybody. You almost have to go to quite extreme measures to get hurt. So these clothing bins are put in place to make it more convenient for people to donate. The district says its bins will remain closed until a more secure option is figured out. It's unclear how long this may take. By the time we work through this, we're hoping that we'll have another convenient option, one that's safe. Uh, we don't know what that looks like now. It'll probably be different, but um, we're committed to still making that available. Removing is going to have its own disadvantages as well. I mean, closing or removing. At the moment, it bin is for helping wanted ones, right? Well, I think if it's not safe, I think they need to be safe. I think that's the most important thing. And so they need to look at a different design. In West Vancouver, Greg Harper, City News.